In South Texas this morning, the concerns are about flooding, not fire. Tropical Storm Hermine made landfall late last night and is dumping huge amounts of rain. CBS News correspondent Don Teague is on South Padre Island this morning with the latest on that storm. Don, good morning. Good morning, Erica. This storm developed and intensified so quickly that many residents along the South Texas coast had no time to prepare for it. Fortunately, the storm also made landfall before it could become a hurricane. It was a surprise storm that almost became a hurricane. Tropical Storm Hermine began Monday morning as a tropical depression, but by early evening had strengthened with 65 mile per hour winds and driving rain. For residents along the Texas coast, it was a threat that seemed to come from nowhere. Came up, you know, from Mexico and came up north. So, I mean, it is different for sure. Hermine made landfall in Mexico, just 40 miles south of Brownsville, Texas. The winds, less of a problem than the rain, which caused flooding and mudslides in Mexican villages that destroyed at least 20 homes. The storm could dump four to eight inches of rain or more in South Texas and is forecast to continue dropping heavy rain as it moves north to Oklahoma. Well, the schools are closed in many cases here in South Texas as a precaution. It's not raining right now, but there has been very heavy rain and there's still heavy rain as the storm moves north. That is the major threat from flooding across much of Texas later today. Erica? Don, thanks.